Rural Electrification Agency has in a move to bolster electricity supply across the country has secured an additional $750 million World Bank fund to provide electricity to over 17 million households. The managing director of Rural Electrification Agency, Malam Abba Abubakar Aliu, at a media briefing on 2023 performance of the agency emphasized that government is concerned about making electricity supply available to the citizenry. Our correspondent, Ugundano Aniola, has details of this report. Managing Director of Rural Electrification Agency, Mr. Abba Abubakar Liu, in his address, noted that the agency spent over 28 billion naira on capital electricity projects that includes consultancy, deployment of mini grids, grid extension, deployment of solar home systems, solar street lights, and solar irrigation pumps out of an allocated 31.7 billion naira for the year 2023. The REA spent it out of the 2023 capital implementation, we have completed a project of over 28.7 billion out of the 31.7 billion allocated to REA. We still have about 3.3 billion projects that are ongoing, which we hope to complete uh, in the next two months. Um, this, the distribution of the REA project covered the entire six polit political zones and at the same time also covered the entire 36 plus FCT state across the country. Director of Technical Services, Rural Electrification Agency, Engineer Uma Abdullah Uma in his address, said agency is committed to community engagement to ensure adequate security and maintenance of implemented electrical projects. He noted that the agency is also collaborating with manufacturers for better production of equipment to improve lifespan of implemented projects. Uh, over the years we have found out that in projects whereby the communities are fully engaged, uh, these projects are more successful. We have less cases of theft, less cases of vandalism. So we, we will keep leveraging on the community-led rural electricity users cooperative societies to ensure the success of this approach for all our projects, even going to the 2024 and beyond. And also, of course, to ensure community uh, inclusion in all our projects. Uh, another key issue is that of the issue of quality control and enforcement of standards and specifications. Because part of uh, what we're facing is the presence of a lot of counterfeit of uh, various equipment in the market. So, in fact, we've had engagement with some of these manufacturers, and uh, in some cases, they would even estimate as far as 90% of their equipment that are out there are actually counterfeit. So, we're also doing a lot uh, to try to see how we address these problems. The media briefing was conducted to enlighten the public on plans of the government to bolster adequate electricity supply nationwide. From the nation's capital, Ogudan Eniola, ADBN News.